The school implements a comprehensive assessment system that generates a range of data about student learning and school effectiveness and uses the results to guide continuous improvement. Hello, my name is Dan Harbison. I'm a social studies teacher here at Sodotna High School and I'll be walking you through Standard 5.1. Standard 5.1 the school establishes and maintains a clearly defined and comprehensive student assessment system. Soldatna High School has established and maintained clearly defined and comprehensive student assessment systems. More changes are coming in the 2014-2015 school year. Assessments Dashboard Cumulative Files Quarter Assessments Rubrics National Assessments And Action Hi, I'm Kristen McLaughlin, and I'm the computer tech teacher here at Soldotna High School. Standard 5.2 Professional and support staff at Soldotna High School continuously collect, analyze, and apply learning from a range of data sources, including comparison and trend data about student learning, instruction, program evaluation, and organizational conditions. Start. Hi, I'm Mr. Carlson, and this is where we actually apply all the academics from science and math and believe it or not, even language arts. With fiber optic connection directly to our district server, we at Soldotna High School have truly instant access to a wide variety of individualized and general student data direct, directly through links in our daily attendance program as well as the district dashboard. Each teacher is equipped with an online grading system called PowerTeacher that keeps track of graded assignments. This information is fed into the PowerSchool system that gives parents, advisory teachers, and administration specific information on how a student is performing on daily and assessment work at any given time during the day, week, or quarter. Administration and teachers use this information to identify students that may need additional support. Advisory teachers can also use this information to conference with students when they are slipping behind or congratulate students on a job well done. When the dashboard and power school systems are used in conjunction with each other, all interested parties can analyze data to set relevant goals at all levels, district-wide, school-wide, and in the classroom. Evidence with results of school-wide cross-curricular intervention for deficit measuring math skills illustrate the effectiveness of analyzing, modifying, and reevaluating nationally standardized test data as Soldotna High School made dramatic improvements in test-specific subject areas. This information allows me as a shop teacher to reinforce, enhance, and build needed math science and language arts skills through direct application in measuring, layout, troubleshooting, analysis, materials processing, research, and application of research procedures. It also allows me to monitor progress and make needed modifications to general and individualized instruction and verify results on a continuous basis. Hi, I'm Margaret Griffin. Here in the counseling office, we help kids uh, with their career and future planning. Standard 5.3 addresses the need for all staff members to be not just aware of data and not just to be able to access the data, but that they are trained on how to interpret and understand and appropriately use the data to monitor student learning. The way we accomplish that is through the use of our in-service meetings. 
our administrators dedicate time for all the major sources, including SBAs, high school graduation qualifying exam, work keys, AWAs, and the science SBA. Our administrators also dedicate in-service time to train all staff on use of the district dashboard, where teachers can find all kinds of information, including attendance records and assessment score gains, assessment score drops. Administrators train teachers how to sort the dashboard data in multiple ways, by grade level, by teacher, and even uh, by their at-risk status and more. Only pertinent staff, such as school counselors, are trained to interpret data from sources such as the SAT, ACT, ASVAB, and PSAT. We conduct quarterly department meetings, and we discuss our effectiveness in bi-monthly, smaller learning team meetings. Finally, our teacher evaluation tool holds teachers accountable by addressing the teacher's ability to use data effectively to monitor student learning. And action. Hi, I'm Dave Justice. I'm part of the resource team at Soldatna High School. Soldatna High School is dedicated to a continuous process to determine verifiable improvement in student learning, including readiness for and success at the next level. The goal of response to intervention is to identify students with learning difficulties. This is done through a wide array of differentiated instruction, which allows us to make data-based decisions. Once identified, an Individual Educational Program, or IEP, is developed for that student. In short, the IEP addresses each student's specific learning needs. An integral component of the IEP is a focus on that student's post-secondary transition needs and goals. And action. Hi, my name is Cheryl Brown, and I'm part of the Special Education Department here at Soldotna High School. Soldotna High School offers job training programs for those students interested in specific vocations. Programs such as cooperative work experience, on-the-job training opportunities, as well as mentorships assist students with gaining valuable skills needed to succeed in today's workplace. Project Rewards is an incentive program implemented by Soldotna High School. This program rewards students for academic achievement, citizenship, and attendance. Students are eligible for project rewards in each of their classes if they meet the requirements set forth. Students eligible for project rewards have the option of not taking their final exams or taking the final without the consequences of bringing their grade down. And action. Hi, my name is Sarah Erfurt and I teach English language arts. Standard 5.5 addresses how well Sedotna High School in the Kenai Peninsula Borough School District has made a deliberate effort to use the data that it has collected in order to support and improve student learning, as well as advance school and district goals. You can see here our district goals. We have listed the current reality, which we know from our data, a specific goal to reach, and then the strategies and action steps that need to occur in order to reach that goal. This is then broken down into individual responsibilities, timelines, and the evidence that should be produced in order to demonstrate progress. We also have tasks clearly broken into specific committees and meeting dates that are displayed on the district website. This allows for communication within the community about how their responsibility for progress is shared and achieved by the district.
There is a very similar process for the goals specific to Soldotna High School. By instituting clear steps, allocating responsibility, planning ahead, and producing evidence, it is possible to use data in order to transform our goals into realities.